Hi, uh, and what I want to do is show you how you can take all of your Firefox settings from one computer to another. Some of you might know how to do this, but um, a lot of you probably don't. And if you're anything like me and Firefox, you know, you'd be devastated if you lost it. Then you really want to be taking notice of this, okay? Um, now what Firefox does, it stores all of your information on how you use Firefox, your bookmarks, your passwords, um, your add-ons, any extensions that you use. It stores it all in a profile folder. Okay, um, And what you need to do is you need to back that up, first of all, okay, somewhere external. Okay, So what you're going to do, this is um, the default location okay, for the Firefox profile folder. So forget about the X's on the end. All you're going to do is you're going to copy this part of it here. Okay. And go down to your search bar and paste that in there. And you'll see that that opens up. Okay. Now this is your the default profile. Okay. Well, this is the profile. This is everything that you use when you're using Firefox. Now what you need to do is copy that information okay, into um, either a, a CD or a USB stick or an external hard drive somewhere. Okay, I've already done it. I've um, copied that profile. As you can see I've got an external hard drive there. I've created a folder on there and there's the folder that I use for Firefox. Okay, So that's all of my information that Firefox has about me. Okay. Now, let's assume that you know you've got a new computer, a new laptop or a whole new desktop PC, whatever it is, you've got a new computer and you've downloaded Firefox. Firefox again will have created a default profile for you. And what you need to do is you need to override that one with the profile that you were using on the old computer. Okay? And it's really simple to do. So again, all you would do is you would just copy that, okay, you just open up your profile folder again, okay, there it is, so you just open it up. Now this is, remember, this is the default profile on the new computer, and then all you would do, you would plug in your USB stick or your CD drive, wherever you've got the backed up profile, and you simply select all of this and copy it and paste it over this. So you're just overwriting the profile that's on the new computer with the profile that you've backed up from your old computer. Okay, you will need to close Firefox um, when you're doing it, but that's it. So do do make a backup copy of your Firefox profile because if your computer crashes and burns and you do have to get a new one, and um, you know if you're anything like me and you don't have a clue what the passwords are for any of your um, sites that you you know you normally visit every day or you would just be totally lost without it okay you don't want to have to start all over from scratch so back up your profile and then you you know that you've got it okay and that's how easy it is um, and this by the way is the URL for the tutorial if you want to go um, but if you just go you know to Firefox to their support um, and just type in backing up your information you'll find the article easy enough okay there you go